Welcome to the world according to Jason. Today we are going to try out one of my most favorite treats that I have ever found in Japan. Alright, so first time I came to Japan, we were fumbling around through the Shinjuku station, trying to find our way around and also looking for something to eat for breakfast. And we came across this little shop and it was called Ringo and it had these like custard apple pie things. I don't know how else to describe them, but they're like a little flaky pastry crust with custard and like apple pie filling on it. And it was like so amazing. It was one of the highlights of the of the trip in terms of like sweets. And then the second time we came back to Japan, we went back to Shinjuku Station and wandered around like lost trying to find this place and we never were able to find it. So I made an effort to find it again this time. And so I was in the Shinjuku area, I was next to the station, I found like a tourist information booth. So I went inside and I asked them, where can I find this? They said, oh, the one in Shinjuku closed. So they pointed me to another outlet in Ikibukuro. So I went to the Ikibukuro station and just outside, like when you leave the north, like the east north exit, you'll take a left and head towards the big BIC camera. And then as you get to the corner, you'll see this small little shop, like very small standing room only, um, but it's called Ringo. And the smells coming out of that shop will be enough to, uh, to pull you in. So I went in and they actually have a like limited edition one as well. And it has uh, caramel in it. So I got, uh, they had like, a, you buy them in boxes of four. So I bought two of the original and two of the caramel ones. And I couldn't find any place nearby to like, to, to film this and it's raining. So I couldn't find a, like obviously a park outside or any benches outside were out of the question. So I came back to the hotel. So today, is a very special day. I'm so glad I was able to find it and I want to share it with you guys. We're going to try the OG one first. So you can see it's got like a beautiful flaky crust. The apple pie filling's just spilling out. It's a little sticky. So definitely use the wrapper as like a little pastry diaper. And uh, yeah, so we're going to try out the original one first. Original one going in. Mm. Oh. Mm. It's even better than I remember. Man, it's got like chunks of real apple in there and they're just so soft, but they have that like, app, like, you know, when you have an apple pie, the apples are like, they're soft, but they still kind of have like a little crunch. Um, that's what you're getting here. And then the pastry crust is like super buttery and delicious and flaky and awesome. Mmm. You can see the filling there. That custard is so nice and creamy and eggy and sweet. I remember Matt and I were like so bummed that we couldn't find this when we came last time. And so Matt, at least I know where they're at now. So next time we come, I can take you there. That was something to behold. All right. And the caramel one here, you can see it kind of has just like a caramel drizzle on the top. I'm not sure if the caramel is like on the inside as well, if it's just like a little drizzle on the top but the caramel custard apple pie going in. Oh, 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 mm. wow. That is amazing. That is so good. Instead of the normal custard, it's actually like a, like a caramel cream or like a caramel pudding. This is really good. This is, this one is super delicious, but I love that the, the flavor that the caramel sauce and the, caramel drizzle bring to it, but I kind of, 
I think I like between the two of them. I think I prefer the one with the, the custard in it because that custard is so tasty and so delicious. And it like, I think it kind of plays better with the apple and the, the pastry crust than this caramel sauce does, but they're both super delicious. Well, all right, folks, that was amazing. I'm so glad that they taste just as like amazing and epic as I remember. And so again, I'm gonna put a link down in the description below where you can find the branch that I went to. I think they have a few others spread out throughout the city, but this one is super easy to find if you go to the Ikebukuro station. So if you're in Japan and you're in the area, this place is definitely worth paying a visit. Again, I prefer the original one to the caramel one. The caramel one is a little bit of a, I think a seasonal thing. So it might be like a winter exclusive. I couldn't find any like date range on when they're available, but well, that's gonna be it for today's video. I sure hope you liked it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you think you'd like the original or the caramel one better? And also remember, if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe and hit the bell notification. So as soon as new videos pop up, you're gonna be the first to find out about it. Thank you so much for sticking around to the end and until next time, stay curious.